In this video, the topic is type 1.5 diabetes mellitus. Now, most of the people know type 1 diabetes where there's a total lack of insulin and then, then there's an adult onset where there's insulin resistance, pre-diabetes and type 2 diabetes and people are managed differently. People with type 1, they need insulin. People with type 2, they are usually managed with oral medication. But there's a distinctive diabetes called type 1.5 diabetes. It's called LADA, L-A-D-A, means latent autoimmune diabetes in adults. And it has features of both type 1 and type 2 diabetes, which is why it is often called type 1.5. So LADA, latent autoimmune diabetes in adults, that is type 1.5 diabetes mellitus, a slowly progressive autoimmune diabetes that develop in adults. The immune system attacks insulin producing beta cells like in type 1 diabetes, but process is slower. So patients don't require insulin immediately. Early on, it may look like type 2 diabetes because it often appears in adults who are not always lean and they may initially respond to oral medications. The clinical feature usually onset is in adults in their 30s and 50s, but can occur outside the, this range. Patients are often not obese, unlike many type 2 diabetes. Initially, it is controlled with oral anti-diabetic drugs, but within few months to years, they usually require insulin therapy because there is total lack of insulin from autoimmune destruction of beta cells. Symptoms are similar to type 1 diabetes or type 2 diabetes, polyuria, polydipsia, weight loss, fatigue, and it's often misdiagnosed as type 2 diabetes. So pathophysiologically, um, there's an autoimmune obstruction, destruction of beta cells, similar to type 1, but it happens gradually. Um, and there are antibody testing, um, which can really reveal uh, type 1.5 diabetes, and it's called anti-GAD66, um, anti-GAD65, isolate cell antibodies, and it's insulin autoantibodies. Progress is more slowly than classic type 1. So the residual amount of insulin secretion persists longer. So how do you diagnose this one? It's adult onset diabetes. People are usually thinner um, and there's a positive pancreatic autoantibodies. C-peptide level, which is the endogenous insulin secretion is really low or declining, so reduced insulin production. Uh, and there's a gradual poor response to oral agents over time. Treatment, you use oral hypoglycemics like metformin, glipizide, etc. in the beginning. Eventually, insulin is required as beta cell function declines. Lifestyle modification is always important, diet, exercise, um, and um, usually in this kind of uh, diabetics, we don't use sulfonyl urea like a glipizide, glucotrol, um, etc. The key points to remember is type 1 diabetes, rapid autoimmune, insulin dependent from start. Type 2 diabetes mellitus, insulin resistance, often with obesity, Gradual onset may not need insulin, type 1.5, LADA, autoimmune like type 1, but slower onset looks like type 2 at the first, but eventually when there's a full destruction of beta cells, it will require insulin. In summary, type 1.5 diabetes, LADA, is an autoimmune diabetes in adults that starts off like type 2, but progresses in insulin dependence like type 1. So thank you for watching.